What's up everybody? Blue Gabe. Before I even get started on all of this, I got to give a huge shout out to Simply Safe for sponsoring this video. Now we can get to Mr. Jake Arrington, Mr. Maverick, whose dad is the reason we're here, and we got Luke. Luke, you want to show the camera something? What'd you kill this morning? This. What is that? It's a big old duck. A big old duck, I Jake. I got the biggest duck in the day. You, you always get the biggest of whatever we're getting for some reason, even though it might not be, but well. But I didn't get the biggest buck, but you guys got the biggest Jake buck. Jake did, not me. You can't blame that on me. Jake did. What'd you shoot today, Jake? Uh, I shot some of these. I shot five ducks. And, uh, no, you shot six because you shot one at the first spot. Oh, yeah. And uh, I'm using my M2 Benelli. 20, 20 gauge, gauge? Mm -hmm. that's what I'm talking about folks at home so these are blue wing teals I know we have a green wing in here somewhere I saw him earlier and these are model ducks so you're allowed in Florida five teal and one model duck or six teal so I do have some awesome duck hunting footage and I'm going to show you that in a minute but that's not even what we're here for today we did come to duck hunt but you see what's in there right there that's my 12 foot sardine net and right over my shoulder about a mile that away is a ditch that has a little circular area in it where two culvert pipes are dumping in and it makes a deeper hole and we drove by it a minute ago and there are so many fish in it it's insane i want to take that cast net it's about as big as the hole so i'm going to catch everything that's in there and we're going to see what it is but right now i need to take a second and tell you a little bit more about Simply Safe, which there's no safe like Simply Safe, and that's why I have it. It's a security system for your home, and it's the best on the market, in my opinion. It costs less than a dollar a day. If you don't like it, you can send it right back, no questions asked. It's the easiest to install. They have inside cameras, outside cameras, doorbell cameras. You literally, you can't beat Simply Safe. It's serious home security made simpler. If I can install it, you can too. So obviously y'all know I have kids. I also have a bunch of boats. I got a little dog, Redneck, and that's why I felt it was important to get a home security system. Whenever I'm gone on trips like this right now, we're in Naples. I can get on my phone on my mobile app and check on my house via the cameras. Look at it, see it. Okay, we're good. And if something was to go wrong, Simply Safe has live agents ready to send the police, the firefighters, EMT in case of an emergency. How do you go wrong with that? And right now, if you go to simplysafe.com slash bluegabe, you can save up to 20% off your entire order. What else do I need to say? Who shot the most ducks? Oh, I shot my Look, Maverick's like, what? Uh, uh, uh. I, I, so I will say that I sat with Luke this morning I had to help him out a little bit, put his gun on the chair, and he was able to whack some ducks. Jake, on the other hand, sat by himself and killed his limit. Maverick, how old are you, Maverick? Five. He's five, and you killed two? Son, that's pretty dang good right no, there. I think I killed one. One? You got him, son. What number is that? <laughs> Did that gun kick? Look at me. You got number six on your first limit of ducks. Get ready, Get right to your right. Go, 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 go to your right. Has Luke been riding around with that duck the entire time? They had it in their mouth and everything else. <laughs> Jake's been whacking them. He got spied. Luke, hold your duck up. Is that your buddy? Yep. He's a big one. It's the biggest duck we've got yet. 
who's ready to clean it up. Come on, Jake. Let's clean one, Jake. So Jake's already started on this one. He got a little bit excited. He folks at home, he didn't. He was trying not to wait on you. So we're show him what we're gonna do real quick. I know right, how so to clean a duck. It's like we'll a dove. Start plucking. Um, it's like a dove kind of, but we gotta take these feathers out. I need to find a knife. Do we have a Danko? I don't know. Hopefully. I hope we do. Here, come over here. Let me see. I hope we do. Well, I, I have to borrow I somebody's watch, knife. I watched this truck on on YouTube. Nope. I don't think I have a knife. Any of y'all got a knife to clean a duck? Y'all let me introduce you, Mr. Justin with Strictly Outdoors. Yeah. This is Maverick's dad and he's who invited us out today. If you saw my crawfish video where we were sticking our hand down in the dirt hole, that was with him. A snipe video was with Justin. All right, Jake, Jake, you, you're already on your way. Mm -hmm. Here. You want me and to rip off these rails? Rails? No, just rip the feathers off. You hold them this way, take the knife, slice it right there. And just like flaying a fish, lay it right open. You just pop that little nugget out of there. Now, some people will pluck the whole entire bird with us with these little teals. We don't do it, we just want these little breasts. There we go. Look at that. Ooh. So, you saw us clean one. We're going to clean all 30 of these, or how many ever there are, and then we'll see all over there at this culvert pipe. I have no idea what we're going to catch, but I guarantee you it's going to be a lot of something and probably multiple species. Species that I might not even have seen before yet. We're here. Let's see what this place has in store for us right now. Oh my goodness, no. There's a pump running. Oh, this hole was a lot lower earlier. That's all right though. We can still throw the net. I'm gonna go over there on that bank and throw it this way. They just turned this pump on. That's all tomato fields over there. And as far as your eyes can see that away. Oh man, this water was crystal clear. Well, it should be interesting. I'm pretty stoked to see what's in there. I have no idea. Like none. I don't know what'll be in there. So I had to get into my fishing outfit. What you saw me in earlier was my hunting outfit. This is my 12 foot sardine net. It's like 600 bucks and we're about to probably <laughs> trash it. Jake, are you ready to see what's in there? I'm ready. Let's Maverick, go. Maverick, you and Luke. Holy heck yeah. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Now listen, it. there is gators everywhere. We've seen gators all over this place this morning. Big ones and small ones. Actually, Jake, where he was duck hunting, he walked up and was looking in the water and there was a huge one stalking him. And luckily I was able to get over there and throw a stick at him and get him to leave. So we don't know what's in this water, but y'all are about to find out. Yeah, let's do it. I know what's in it. There's catfish. I know it's catfish. I mean, probably fish. Yeah. Why is it going to be Oh, all of this water was clear earlier. Gator, gator, gator. Whoa, what? Yeah, big gator right there. A what? Big gator right there. Oh, great. Film the boys coming down. Come on. Ah. <laughs> I do that. Hey, if that gator jumps at us, it's going to be able to climb back up. Oh. Come on, Jeffrey. You can't stay over there. All right, you stay right there. Make sure you're touching the camera so you can see. Hey, boys, you stay right there.
of souls in here somewhere. Come on, boys, come down. Look what we got, though. Come here, Luke and Jake. Look at this, one, one throw. Come here, Justin, get down in here. There's a peacock. You guys, look at this. There's a peacock in there. You well, never knew there was a peacock in there. I didn't see a peacock, I only saw. Here, back up in the grass. Keep going, back up, Jake. Back up. Look at this. Oh, yeah. he's got a dart. Yeah, he does, he got a couple dogs. I was so hoping I didn't get that alligator in my sardine net. Did y'all see how big he was? I was looking at you when he popped up. Look at this, folks. He got dogs. Big tilapia. One just got out. Oh, it's okay. We got plenty. Oh, we got oh, one. Gone. You yep. kids aren't scared of the alligator? Nope. Look, folks, we got. Alligator again! Hey, Luke! We got big, beautiful. Oh, oh no! Oh! <laughs> big, beautiful Oscars. These are definitely not oh. native. What do you guys got? Hey. We got some gar! He's, Big ones. The bar, the guard just bit me. He did. We've He's got. Gone. Let me see how many species. What is that? Six. You kids know Maverick, there's back up. an alligator in there. Maverick, need to get over there. Back up, son. Other side of us. Okay, yeah, show him that. Show him that. Get in there close, Justin. What kind is it? Oh, let me see. Oh, oh, oh. Look how bud. big this guard is. In a blue game. Here's another species. Look at this thing. That's only down here in South Florida. Will you look? Get over here. Will you find these crazy different species? Look at that, Jake. Hold him. <laughs> now some of y'all are probably thinking we're nuts being right here because that big alligator. Well, I didn't know he was here. I and I I do YouTube for a living, so sometimes you just got to take a, a risk. I don't think he'll get my kids there. He'll, he'll fit Luke back out. Look, oh, here's another big Oscar. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Huge. Big fatty. Oscars are so slimy. Look at the colors. Ha ha, look at that tilapia. A tipitilia. All right, throw them back. We're not killing any of these fish today. We might come back another time. But not today. That's crazy. This I think we need to come back and do another video when the water's clear. What do y'all think? Yeah. yeah. And this is only in, in a 12 foot radius. Yeah. Well, no, this this cast net's 12 foot, so it's actually a 24 foot radius. Oh. Look at that, Jake. What did we catch? 50 fish or more? Probably. Uh -huh. So here's another type of. It's what Maverick had. Look at that. They actually eat these. A lot of people like them. It's called an armored catfish. Normally I would say, let's make another throw. But being that the water's dirty and I can't really see, I'm not gonna do it today. But I'm gonna cook some of these duck for dinner. We'll see y'all back at my house, Stewart, Florida. Also, before we leave, we would have caught a lot more if that pump wasn't running because when it wasn't running that was a real shallow it, it's a small shallow hole that's deep right in the middle right now it's all flooded so the fish can broadcast we will come back here now we'll see you in stewart florida what is that another thing the only native fish we caught that's a bluegill can you two get away from the water we got to go home folks Y'all check this out. Come in close, folks. Come in close, folks. We've got teal, we've got model duck, and a whole lot of goodness right here. Simple as can be. Lowry salt. That's it. If you follow along, you know I love my Lowry salt. Now, obviously, you can tell if you're a duck hunter, the bigger ones are model duck. Come over here. Come over here, folks at home. We're doing it fast and quick. Another model duck. Luke, that's the one you killed. Look, look at little look right here. Did you know you were gonna eat him when you shot him? You better. 
Come over here. We're going to put these little teal in here too. That's just bacon grease, you see. A little bit of bacon grease. Now the trick with duck, you don't want it to cook too long. You want it literally medium rare. If you cook it too long, it will taste like like an organ meat. I'm already going to flip these. The model duck will take a lot longer than the teal. Come in here close and just show them. I wish y'all could smell this. Oh yeah, it's going to be good. Now listen, I know I didn't have the best footage in the world. I was hunting with a seven year old. And by the time I got to Jake, the ducks were starting to get a little bit thinner. So it was hard to get the actual good shot. I am not a really good videographer when it comes to hunting like that. I'm a dad with two little boys. Well, not little, they're, they're getting much bigger. So I did the best I could. The cast knitting though, that's my cup of tea. We're definitely going back to that spot very soon. Oh, did the weedle baby get hurt? Yeah, Are you wounded? Jake was pushing me back and I hit the bird. Now you know how that duck feels that you shot out of the sky. All right, come on, let's show them. All right, let's go. Not folks, don't close. mind any of that over there, folks. I just got back from three trips. Yeah, we'll get to that later. Come on, Jake. All right, let's check this out. Y'all just wait till you see this. Come in here and show them this right here. That's how you cook duck. I mean, look at it. Would you just look at it? So I'm going to put a couple pieces of model duck on the plate and a couple pieces of the teal. For the boys to try come on now let's see this right here oh yep just the same perfect perfect look at that like little chunks of sushi i don't know if they eat this up north but this is called cream of corn so we've got some model duck some teal some cream of corn and white rice it does not get any better than that thank you dear god for this day thank you for dying on the cross for our sins Please help this food nourish our bodies and please be with those who don't have food. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. All right, Luke. I want you to try the little one first and then the big one. This one? Yep, that one. That's the teal. That's the bird you shot. Is it good? Where are, you, are you looking? You're looking at Redneck like you want to feed him? Now try the big one. He wants to get feed him. All right, Jake, come on. We had a little bit of a bullet hole, so we're just gonna we're gonna start off with the teal. Come on, let's do it. What you think? It tastes just like venison. Luke, did you try a big one yet? And now we'll try a big one. Let's try it. Mm. One thing. One thing I'll tell you. Duck can be the worst tasting thing on the planet if you overcook it. If you cook it medium rare like that and some bacon grease, you don't need to put sour cream and jalapenos and all of that. Simple. Bacon grease, Lowry's garlic salt, medium rare, and it will taste identical to deer meat or a good steak. I think it goes to the model duck. The model duck's the best? What one do you think? Model. Red duck? You tell me, which one do you think? Nothing. He's he's not even worried about it. The best thing to do is get a piece of steak and get rice on it. That's good. Oh yeah. That's what about this cream of corn though, folks at home? It's good. Leave a comment below if you eat cream of corn. It's just corn and cream. That's it. Whew, it's good. That's it, folks. This was a short, fast one. I've got a new one coming tomorrow from Crystal River. I went spear fishing and I shot the biggest kingfish I've ever shot. I didn't even know I had it on film. I shot some hogfish. I shot some grouper. Had a good friend with me, two good friends with me, and I'm going to make a video of that tomorrow. Then the boys and I are leaving to a secret place. I can't tell them. It's top secret, and y'all will not know until I get there and make my first video. That's it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Like Jake always says, though, it's time to get up out of here. Get the heck out of shape.